Hey folks, welcome back to Let's Play Breath of Fire 3. I'm the Mysterious JG. I just checked a fact because I realized I didn't even try to steal from that boss. Uh, you can get silver mail from him. I don't think that's really worth going back for. However, uh, thanks to the fact I checked, I did realize something. I learned something, basically, I wasn't aware of before. Which is that Ray can pick locks. We hadn't really encountered a lot of locked doors before, and it's just possible that in the beginning of the game, I missed some chances to pick locks. I'm pretty sure you can't get through here. But, uh, we can, even though there's guards standing right here, we can pick locks with him to get in here and get the deluxe rod. Nina is going to be thrilled to find out that we've got vodka shot. Nothing. Nothing. Nina should be very happy now that uh, Avatar has a deluxe rod. But at any rate, no, um, ha ha ha, penis. No, um, yeah, that being the case, I'll probably end up keeping uh, Ray in my party quite a lot. Uh, now, of course, one of the problems I've got with Ray right now is he just, unless I'm mistaken, he does not have a master. Yeah, he does not have a master. But if we can get past uh, those guards who are blocking us from taking the road back to Windia, we should have access to most of the masters we were able to get earlier in the game. Not perhaps all. I really wish we didn't have to keep climbing Mount whatever it is. But I believe we do. I don't know why this is like the only place they make us go through again and again. I mean, obviously it ain't exactly a challenging dungeon, but... I really don't want Ray leveling up until he's got a master, because he'll be, well, he'll be losing some minor stat gain possibilities, but that's about it. Not a big deal. Dang, these things are really putting a hurting on some of our guys. Well, for one thing, I need to think about changing my, um... Go to normal. And have uh, Nina be in the back. That probably makes the most sense. We really need to heal, but yeah, we go. I figured we could probably get out of there. I don't even remember what was over here. Is this a dragon gene or. Oh, is this just one of those weird... Yeah, I... Are we ever going to figure out what those things are? I still don't get to rest here. What a jip, man. possible this handful of battles will make a difference to the uh, fairies. What did it say? Culture level rose. Oh. So... I don't know how high the culture can get, but I think they're doing eh, fine. That's fine. What they're doing is fine. Guess I'll see if you want to sell me anything more useful. I don't think you have new jobs to do. Oh. This is the house of new job thinking up. You guys are developing culture. 
Try to think how we can grow faster. But there was a freaking shop, wasn't there? Oh, this is only considered two buildings, and then this place was the shop, I think. We're gonna get nothing but the best. It's the best! Alright! Yeah, that pointed stick. This is truly the best ever. The equipment is awesome. You're awesome, King! Alright, fine. Forget about you guys. Keep it up. As far as I know, there's really no way to break the fairy minigame. Unless, like, you have no one hunting and they just starve to death. You can always kind of bring them back. Even if you mismanage it somewhat. And I think... Oh, you can, it seems to me like if that last boss is supposed to be one of the toughest bosses in the game that I've already horrendously over leveled just in trying to learn the skills and really I need to just chillax and not worry about getting a perfect run in this game because I've already obviously got screwed up emulation issues with the sound <laughs> and uh, just get through the game and enjoy I'm, I'm enjoying it I, I like the, the story I like the characters I'm really having fun with this game but um yeah, I can't bring myself to get too worked up about finding everything, because I know from looking at the facts that there are no multiple endings. So my big fear would be not even being able to showcase the different endings. Oh, you know what? I should probably talk to everybody with him and see if they recognize him. Come take a look. It's in a book. Reading Rainbow. That's fine. And otherwise, you save load cheating. You do need to be able to buy replacement lures for the fishing game. This village that used to be called McNeil Village. Now it's called the John Lovitz character's village. Now that I think about it, the only ones who ever wanted any weapons were those little punks. <laughs> what a douchebag. Still referring to uh, the Avatar Tipo and Ray as punks. Yeah, you know, there's probably no reason to save at the end. I don't think anybody's missing max hit points. I came to see what was going on, but it's all over now. It's all over. War is over. I wouldn't mind paying high taxes to Princess Nina were mayor. So was that like a proposition or... It doesn't seem to really... No work here. I guess... Is it just like he's he's gonna pay high taxes to have a hottie around? Or is it like that he thinks that she would actually use the money to help them somehow? Don't you come in here like that when I'm cleaning. I'm the fucking mayor, bitch! So all you come is step aside! I'm the mayor of the Little People Nation. Do, 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 do. So if I was going to get over, just out of curiosity to take a look at the... Ooh, hey. But won't you have to work just as hard there as here? I've had it with the country. Maybe I'll head off to Windia. Oh, I forgot to look at Sin City. Ah, eh, well, it's probably still empty. Forgot to look at Sin City, but if I went back there now, I'd have to fight past the damn uh, mountain again. And eh. I mean, it doesn't take very long, but considering that I don't think there's anything there... Uh, I'll tell you what I'll do. We will quick save. Not quick load, quick save. I believe this is after we've defeated the uh, evil dude. No, it's not. 
I don't even have all the characters in my party. This is definitely the wrong point to be loading from. Alright, how about, uh... Yeah, that's right. I'm just getting completely sloppy uh, in the middle of my recording session. At least I've got my actual party with me here, so this is this is the correct. Uh... I was coming here to make sure that I had the correct um... save save slot. Hey, the town is back. This place is called Sin City. You can find whatever you're looking for here for a price. Wow, so nothing has changed. Me, I'm still selling whatever you want me to, big boy. Have you ever heard about coupons? It's an item that will let you buy anything in the world cheaper. kind of works a lot safer than going after some were tiger any day speaking of were tigers uh there are were tigers still hanging out right hey, I got everything for diapers and tombstones I want diapers and tombstones buddy and you don't have either what the hell weapons armor you name it I got it yeah so this is the armor that we could have gotten from uh oh jeez I might have to come back here off screen because it looks like there actually is useful stuff here. Well, I guess all the bad stuff we were up to, we make an enemy or two along the way. Like, I could have gotten better gear for Ray, although I'm sure there'll be better gear available elsewhere, too. And this place is completely empty. So now it's a normal town. And I could have, in theory, bought some new armor and stuff there, but whatever. That was the right load, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Oh, whoa, 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 hey, hey, no! Sorry, guys, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, we're back. So we'll take a quick look at the, uh, Mayor McCheese's place, if we can get in, we can't. They say Wendy is going to manage this manor from now on. Does that mean I get to be a Wendy and guard? Yeah, I just have to grow some wings, butthead. Because everyone in Wendy has wings. Except that they don't. But I do. I don't know. Never mind. So the people of Wendy just get to take over this town, like, whenever they want to. That's pretty awesome. Uh, yeah, somebody raised the question in the comments, and to be honest with you, I don't know whether... I mean, Windia seems sometimes to refer to a region. Sometimes it seems just to refer to that one city with a castle. Baleo and Sunder seem to be operating within Windia, and they didn't have any real fear of the authorities. This is Ural region. But then you get the central Windia, so... I don't know. Fudge. I was really kind of hoping we could keep going through here. We've got to get to... Um, I was gonna. I was hoping we can get back to uh, a master for uh, Ray, other than, like, you know, the... What's his name from the very beginning of the game? The woodchopper guy. There's like a thief who would help Ray with agility, which is his primary stat, I believe. <laughs> you know, it looks like the story's gonna take over from here. And again, there might be some new masters in uh, Windia. You need to use the Eastern Bridge, right? Mm hmm. Yeah. But this time, I don't think Daddy, the King, will let me go. He thinks it's your fault I ran away the first time, Avatar. Avatar. Well, 
It is. You have no will of your own. I guess uh, that being the case, uh, we'll leave you here. Bye, Nina. But I have an idea. She really likes doing the whole akimbo thing in this game. Avatar, you broke up the black market. Mafia, right? All you need is one more feather in your cap. And even he will have to admit you are a real hero. You're a real man, Avatar. Remember the Malamo. I mean, remember the plant. Remember the deal. Where they grow the vegetables using chrism energy? Yeah. It looks like there's something funny going on there lately. Well, there was something funny going on there before. I've been thinking we need to check it out, so... Gar is, like, just annoyed by this, but whatever. Why don't you help me? I'm sure the king will forgive you. If you help me solve this problem, right? Really? Great! The Avatar didn't say anything, Nina, but whatever. We know who wears the pants in this family. Let's go then. Or the pink tights. The plants down the road to the east. Oh. Enemies. What about this road? Oh, this is fine. This is basically taking me where I wanted to go. More or less. Although, actually, it's significantly easier to, uh... I'm gonna take another quick look at the arena, arena town. See if they're selling anything different or new. I doubt it. You got the Sin City music on. Have you ever heard of the... I've heard of Screw. Oh, you have? Really? Well, then, have you ever heard of Mayumi Nakamura? Oh, you haven't? Really? Stop. Alright, fine. I remember the last contest all those years ago. Let's see, Gar won, and he asked for some kids as a surprise. What a freak! There's no business here at all. Prices are the same now. <laughs> nice. Maybe it's time to close up shop and move on. Hey. Oh, they they forced uh They forced Gar back into my party for that cinematic. I wanted to see uh Rich on. This hasn't really been a very eventful video, has it, folks? I apologize for that. We've had some plot stuff happen, I guess. And our first camping trip since getting Ray back in the party. Hee hee hee, I don't mean to twist your arm like that. I'd rather twist something up. Oh. But if you help me with the plan, I'll talk to my father. About the passport, okay? We'll need Nina's help if we want to get a passport. Of course, we could just kill the guards, but... The princess certainly has a way with people. By the way, when the fuck did you meet a princess? What do you want to do? Oh, yeah, I want to switch party members, too. You know, I don't... I actually like Gar as a character. This is the, Other than, perhaps, uh, the plant guy who doesn't really have a personality and isn't really meant to. Uh, I kind of like all the characters, so it's not like there's anybody that I'm really irritated at having, having my party. I mean, I'd probably rather have... Certainly rather have Nina. I'd probably rather have Gar than, you know, say, Hope or uh, Fang. <laughs> okay, change party members. And... Uh, Get Rachel on in there. 
along with uh, Grandpa and Yuichiro. So that was the way to get to, uh, the best way to get over there. Well, it was the only way to get over there a long time ago, and then we got to a point in the plot where we can no longer really get there that way. I'm wondering if there are other masters we could be talking to. I think there's supposed to be other masters to become available in Windia. Certainly we haven't been here since... What? Wanna play a game, big boy? Whoa! Wait a minute. You wanna challenge us to a game of hide and seek? Don't you... Uh, no. Oh, okay, come back if you wanna play again. These are the kids from we played hide and seek with when they were, you know, kids. Uh, come and find me if you can. Come and find me if you can. I've played lots of games. Sexy games. Hide and seek's the best. That's what I thought. Okay, but we're not just kids anymore. We won't just hide here in Windia. But all over the world, all over the world, for example, I'll hide somewhere in the Northwest where there's lots of strong men. Whoa! And I'll hide someplace close. Hmm. I'll go to that place that smells like oil. I wonder where I should go. I know, I'll hide at the place that connects this world with that world. Come and find me. So, what do you think? Don't worry, we'll make it worth the trouble f to find us. You don't need any more hints, do you? Just one more. Okay, listen closely. I'll hide somewhere in the northwest where... Oh, it's the same hint again. Ready? Okay, so if I really feel like finding them, I can check the, uh, the, the walkthrough. I believe training under them doesn't give you stats, but it does give you access to new formations or something like that. I don't know, I remember, I remember reading that it's really... You only need to, like, level up under them once to learn a new formation, but they're not really that useful. If you keep talking like that, I'm going to throw you in the river, so you better behave. Whoa, lady. It's a little kid. I want a juice! I want a piece of cake! Stop something, I got the juice! Stop something, make a bus loose! Wham, bam, bam, bam. Fresh baked bread, warm, soft, delicious, all you can eat. Yeah, boy. Yeah, ha, ha, ha. Still like birds? If only I had wings. I could go visit my boyfriend anytime. Yeah, I got wings, and I'm dragging my boyfriend off to fight crime with me. When she was a kid, she used to play with me every day. Now she don't give a crap, but now all she cares about is her boyfriend. Aww. It's sad. Here in Wendia, bread is one of our staple foods. Guy sounds like he's about to begin a documentary. I'm pretty sure one of the masters that you can get is like a chef, so I'm kind of vaguely keeping an eye out. Or a baker. The actor Tom Baker. We use it for the enhanced crops. It just doesn't turn out right. And if I'm gonna mess around with new masters, I can either A, look around and like, sort of at least have a little sense of playing it blind, or B, I need to just, you know, not do that until after this recording session when I've had a chance to actually look it up. 
Princess Nina, we've heard of your exploits in McNeil Village. I guess you'll be wanting to report to the king immediately. Nope. Not yet. Before I do that, I was thinking of checking out the plant as well. I see. Well then, good luck, princess. Okay, so we can't even go in there. I mean, that not doesn't make a huge difference to me, but I figured we could uh, go in there and talk to some other people. Because I believe, when I mentioned that there was a chef who was a, a master, then I realized it's I don't think it's actually the chef who's like, um, I don't think it's like a baker. I think it actually was uh, the chef from the castle. But I could be completely wrong, so, eh. Well, we got to deal with all of this, uh, there's no point coming down here. We got to deal with all this, uh, whatever's going on with the plant before we can get the passport, which will allow us to go to the area that has the weird fish guy, who is the one that we wanted to get for uh, Avatar's Master, so. Take your time, look around. Yeah, it looks like I really should have uh, stopped at Sin City and done some shopping for El Tigre. looking for anything other than agility to increase. See the guy who sells the Midas Stone? We sell so many Midas Stones, we can't keep them in stock. I think it's paid for itself by now. Anyway, alright, so going to Windy, I didn't really accomplish much other than getting the hide-and-go-seek quest started, and you never know when I might run into one of those guys. There was one guy I wanted to go to the Northwest, where there were lots of strong men. Wonderful, experienced strong men. Come on, I don't want plot to interfere with my uh, quest. I gotta get to the coffee shop, and that way I can get a nice master for Ray. There you go. Oh, that was the wrong way. Messed that up. It's a pretty popular coffee shop, actually. I'm not sure if uh, the frame skipping is actually saving me anything here. You're back again! Anyone want to become my apprentice, yo? All right, then, Ray, from today, you're my apprentice. Nope. So he doesn't really get anything out of this except, because uh, he learned all the skills, but he does get the agility boost. Sadly, there's no ninja that you can learn, like, even better agility boost from. Because, yes, this game is, in fact, very short on ninjas. Well, we're 28 minutes, so I really want to start a new video now. I mean, uh, continue the video now? I probably don't. I probably want to call it a video. Alright, folks. This one will be a little on the short side, but when we do come back, uh, we'll be at the plant. Hey, buddy. I'm just a plant. See you then. Bye-bye.